Hi, I'm Alana, creator and presenter of Creature Tales. Welcome to my classroom and a new unit study story. A Day in the Life of Young Elephants In the heart of the African savanna, a gentle breeze rustled through the tall grasses as a mother elephant led her two young calves, Ellie and Max, on an adventure the sun was just rising, casting a warm golden glow over the landscape, and the air was filled with sounds of chirping birds and the distant calls of other wildlife. As they walked, their mother, named Luna, began to teach Ellie and Max how to forage for food, look for the green leaves and tender shoots, she instructed, using her trunk to pull down a branch laden with delicious foliage. The young elephants watched intently, mimicking their mother's movements, excuse me, movements as they tried to reach the higher branches. After their meal, Luna led her calves to a nearby watering hole. Here, they met other members of their herd. Luna explained the importance of social bonds among elephants. We are a family and we look out for one another, she said, as Ellie and Max played with their cousins, splashing water and trumpeting joyfully. As the day went on, Luna taught her calves to communicate, how to communicate. She demonstrated various vocalizations and body language, showing them how to express their feelings. When you're happy, when you feel happy, you can trumpet loudly, but when you are scared, you should rumble softly, she explained. In the afternoon, Luna took Ellie and Max on a short trek to explore their surroundings. They encountered a group of playful monkeys and watched as they swung from tree to tree. Luna pointed out different animals they saw, teaching her calves about the diverse ecosystem they lived in. As the sun began to set, Painting the sky in hues of orange and pink, Luna gathered her calves close. We must protect our home and all the creatures in it, she said. Every animal has a role to play, and we must ensure that our habitat remains safe for future generations. With their hearts full of knowledge and adventure, Ellie and Max snuggled close to their mother as they made their way back to the herd, ready to share what they had learned about life as elephants. Thank you for joining me today. Ask your parents to like and subscribe if you want to hear more of my creature stories. Copies of activity sheets can be found in my Teachers Pay Teachers store, link below. Here's a few highlights. You'll find some ad, um, counting practice, some adding practice, not shown here. Um, you'll find some comprehension. Do you remember what all these things are called? All these parts of the elephant are called. You'll also find writing projects, um, drawing projects, phonics practice, several different, a couple different levels, and reading practice in a couple different levels. So, Join or follow any of my social media groups, Creature Tales with Alana, to access my homeschooling resources and stay updated on new lessons. Or check out my Google Sites and look for my free pages. I have a few activity pages there. Don't have to pay for. Thanks again and have a wonderful week. Goodbye.